The body of the Skoda Fabia 2 resists the onslaught on the red disc as well, but there are complaints about the quality of the paintwork. So, for example, in places of chips, especially on the thresholds and front arches, over time the paint swells and falls off in pieces. Also, there are claims to the reliability of external electric equipment. Most often, the owners are troubled by the electric wiper drive, and if it fails, you will have to change the trapezoid. Often, the rear window washer malfunctions, often the owners solve this problem on their own by adjusting the cranked nozzle or the shifted drive into place. If water has appeared in the trunk, sealing of all ventilation holes and holes for the lights is required. When choosing a car of this model, you need to know that the larger the size engine you choose, the less problems it will have in the future. The best option in terms of dynamics and reliability is a 1.6-liter power unit, but it also has minor drawbacks. One of the most common sources of this motor is the failure of the throttle position sensor. The pump is not famous for its large resource, so as not to be in an unpleasant situation, it should be changed simultaneously with the timing belt and rollers. Motor 1.2 is equipped with a timing chain drive, the chain resource is quite small, about 100,000 km, and this replacement will result in a rather big penny. It should be noted that if the chain slips and bends the valve, then the engine will have to be changed, since it is not repairable. Also, the disadvantages of this engine include low power, leaking cylinder head gaskets and oil seals. For 1.2 and 1.6 TSI engines, oil consumption increases after 100,000 km. Owners of the Skoda Fabia 2 with a 1.4 atmospheric engine note problems with cold start and prolonged warm-up of the power unit. Ignition coils are not famous for their reliability. It should be noted that all gasoline engines are demanding on fuel quality. Diesel engines are a rarity for our market, but for those instances that are operated by us, we can say that they are reliable, but only on condition that the car is refueled with high-quality diesel fuel. When using low-quality fuel, fuel injector suffers first of all. This model was equipped with a mechanical and automatic transmission, as well as a 7-speed DSG robot. The mechanics proven to be the most problem-free. But it also has its drawback, a small resource of input shaft bearing, 130-150 thousand kilometers. A signal about the need for replacement will be a kind of rumble in the area of U200B, U200B DHE box. The clutch kit will last about the same. The automatic transmission has also proven itself quite well. With proper maintenance, oil change every 60 thousand kilometers and careful operation, it will last 150 to 100 thousand kilometers without repair, after the valve body needs to be replaced. Quite a lot has already been said about the reliability of the DSG robotic box, and unfortunately, their views are only negative, therefore, it is better to refuse to buy a used car with such a transmission. The Skoda Fabia 2 is equipped with a semi-independent suspension, McPherson strut in front, semi-independent beam in the back. Such an alliance does not provide enviable handling and comfort, at the same time, maintenance cost cannot but rejoice. If we talk about the resource of the suspension, then it is difficult to call it not killed. Stabilizers, struts and bushings are considered consumables. Their resource, with careful operation, does not exist 30-40 thousand kilometers. The service life of silent blocks, wheel bearings, change assembly with the hub, ball bearings and tie rod ends rarely exist 80 thousand kilometers. Approximately once every 100 thousand kilometer, you will have to change shock absorbers, thrust bearings, 40-70 thousand kilometers go on pressed island version, but they can creak even after 10 thousand kilometers, and steering rods. Despite the low weight of the car, the brake pads run quite a bit, 30-40 thousand kilometers, the discs twice as long. Despite the low cost of the Skoda Fabia 2, it is worth noting the good quality of interior finishing materials and sound insulation. If we talk about the electrical equipment of the cabin, then, despite the fact that the car does not have a large amount of electronics, it presents surprises quite often. Most often, failures occur with the seat heating system, the central lock stops responding to the K-fob, and the hood and trunk limit switches. Power window and the stove fan can also fail. After the ignition is turned off, the stove continues to work. If you are the owner of this car model, please describe the problems that you had to face during the operation of the car. Perhaps it is your review that will help readers of our site when choosing a car.